Jamaican sprinter Sherika Jackson sprinted herself into the record books at this year's national championships. But who is she? Well, that's a story we're going to tell and also discover how she became one of the best in the game. And what many of her fans are currently interested in is her bank balance, also record-breaking. 28-year-old Sherika Jackson is making headlines after her record-breaking performance at this year's World Championships. Sherika Jackson, born July 16, 1994, is a Jamaican sprinter competing in the 100 meter, 200 meter, and 400 meter. She's officially the fastest woman alive in the 200 meter after her latest feat. She began her career as a 400 meter sprinter, earning bronze in the 2016 Rio Olympics, 2015 World Championships, and 2019 World Championships. At the same competitions, Jackson took gold, silver, and bronze medals in the 4x400 meter relays. She also earned a gold medal in the 4x100 meter relay at the 2019 World Championships. After shifting to shorter sprints in 2021, Jackson won bronze at the 2020 Tokyo Olympics in the 100 meter and added gold and bronze for the 4x100 meter and 4x400 meter relays respectively. That year, she achieved sub 10.8 second and sub 22 second personal bests in the short sprints of the 100 meter and 200 meter. And with her 400 meter lifetime best below 49.5 seconds, she became one of few women to reach such marks at all those events simultaneously. Sherika Jackson has been winning gold medals in different age categories at the Carifta Games and then CACAC Junior Championships since 2008. She first dipped below 51 seconds in the 400 meters at the age of 21 in 2015 and finally managed to break the 50 second barrier a few months later. Under the guidance of renowned sprint coach Stephen Francis, Jackson switched to the 100 meter and 200 meter sprints for the 2021 season, achieving personal bests of 10.77 seconds and 21.82 seconds respectively after running at the Jamaica Olympic Trials in Kingston. In the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, she came third in the 100 meter with a personal best of 10.76 seconds, just behind fellow Jamaican Shelly Ann Fraser Price, who clocked 10.74 seconds. But she can't have everything. In the 200 meter, she didn't make it out of the heats. Her time wasn't good enough to earn her one of the advancement spots. And then it was 2022 when she really hit her stride. Sherika Jackson has become the fastest woman since Flojo. When it comes to the women's 200 meter race at the World Athletics Championships, you need a little something special to strike gold. And Sherika Jackson of Jamaica had it, making for a gold medal winning outcome. Jackson's time of 21.45 seconds would have only been beaten by the legendary Florence Griffith Joyner of the USA, who set her world record time of 21.34 seconds at the Seoul Olympics back in 1988. But that was not all she had to celebrate. At the Jamaican trials, she won the sprint double, clocking 10.77 seconds in the 100 meter dash and 21.55 seconds in the longer 200 meter race, elevating her to number three on the all time list. At the world championships, Jackson placed second in the 100 meter sprint with a time of 10.73 seconds, a personal best and a tie for seventh fastest woman ever. In the 4x100 relay finals, Jackson ran a spectacular split of 9.72 seconds on the anchor leg, but she wasn't able to pass Twanisha Terry from the United States. As a result, Jackson and her Jamaican teammates Kemba Nelson, Elaine thompson Hera, and Shelly Ann Fraser-Price earned the silver medal in a season's best of 41.18 seconds, the sixth fastest time in history. Sherika Jackson also just added to her impressive 200 meter resume with a win at the Wanda Diamond League meeting in Zurich. In 21.80 seconds, Jackson outran her competitors and won the race. Sherika Jackson was closely followed by Tokyo Games bronze medalist Gabrielle Thomas and American Tamara Clark, who finished third in 22.42 seconds. The US is Jenna Prendini, 22.45, and Switzerland's Mujinga Kambunji, 22.65, wound up fourth and fifth respectively. To get to record-breaking levels, she must have pushed herself beyond what most people thought was possible. What's her secret? For those who believe natural talent trumps hard work, take a lesson from Jackson. She didn't become an Olympic champion through the skill and speed she was
was born with. In fact, in her younger years, she was never even on the podium during her high school sports days. I was very slow at primary school, she told Jamaican TV presenter Yendi Phillips. I never won anything or came in the top three before. At sports day, I was very, very slow. Jackson was inspired to be a track athlete during her last year of secondary school after she witnessed her sick coach encourage her to run the 400 meter. Jackson began to develop as an athlete and after qualifying for her first major championships in 2014, she headed to Glasgow. But before the games could begin, Jackson was struck by an injury and couldn't compete. She even began to consider her future in the sport. I was incredibly disappointed because I trained so hard and wanted to do so well, but never even got to touch the track, she recalled. But with the help of her friends and family, Jackson got back to training and just a year later won her first major championships medals, 400 meter bronze and 4x400 meter gold at the 2015 World Athletics Championships. As unlikely as it may seem, world-class runner Jackson professes to not enjoy short distance running. Last year, the runner who has run sub-50 seconds in the 400, sub-22 in the 200 meter and sub-11 in the 100 meter claimed that she doesn't even consider herself a sprinter. She confessed in an interview with Smile Jamaica TVJ that her favorite event of the three she is renowned for is still the longer 400 meter distance. She always had high expectations for herself, even when others might have considered her Tokyo 2020 campaign a success, she was left bitterly disappointed. In the 200 meter, she missed out on the final by four thousandths of a second after slowing down before the line. The experience left her emotionally crippled. I have not watched that video up to this day, she admitted. It's hard to watch. It's difficult to accept. I never said I made a mistake. I don't think it was a mistake. It's just that if it were to be, it would have been. I never wanted to eat. It was hard for me. Despite her disappointment in individual events, however, she showed the resilience that has become her trademark by bouncing back at the same Olympic Games and earning a medal in the 4x400-meter relay. Now, just a year later, she has proven herself to be one of the greatest sprinters in the world. After the harsh lesson of her Olympic 200-meter defeat well and truly internalized, she made good upon her immense promise at the World Championships in Oregon. Given the ups and downs that come with competing, Jackson doesn't have to think too hard about the importance of mental well-being. The runner has always turned to therapy and counseling after every athletic setback and continues to work on her own mental health even during times of success. Jackson is not ashamed to admit that she went to therapy and she even attributes it to her success as an athlete. Fans of Jackson and the sport have always been interested in her earnings and her recent performance has only heightened their curiosity. With respect to her yearly earnings, many have said that she earns about $200,000 a year. Speculation has placed her net worth anywhere between $1 million and $5 million. One could say that Jackson is rich beyond her years, considering the huge sums she's raked in from athletics. And let's not overlook her lucrative endorsements and advertising deals. In January 2017, Jackson signed a contract with Puma, joining Christiana Williams, Megan Simmond, Geneve Russell, Rasheen McDonald, Julian Forte, and Odane Richards on the roster. And now, Sherika Jackson, Scotia Group's first brand ambassador, has reached a new milestone in her career. This might lead to a jump in her net worth as Scotia Group has started sponsoring her in events. You should absolutely check out her social media, at Sherika Jacko. She's very active on Instagram with over 116,000 followers, while she follows 288 people. Her captions are inspirational and full of motivation. In the latest post, she shows gratitude to her friends and family and says a celebratory goodbye to the 2022 season. Throughout the process, I experienced many times of frustration and self-doubt, but thanks to a fantastic team, wonderful friends, and supportive family, I was able to perform at my peak 90% of the time. And what do we know of her personal life? It's reported that she's not married and doesn't have a boyfriend. She is single and focused on her career, an impressive one at that. Sherika is an exemplary role model for athletes and students across the globe. She has proven that with hard work and determination, a person can be successful in any aspect of life. We are left inspired and anxiously awaiting her next record-breaking time. Sherika Jackson, with her history-making sprints and persistence, has proven that determination and hard work can conquer many obstacles. We hope you enjoyed hearing about this phenomenal athlete. Thanks for watching.